Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Minecraft Life in the Woods. Where did this, there he is. You guys voted that uh, I should try and make a friend. That's one bone. That's two bones. That's three bones. Oh boy. Okay, I have two left over. Now, a lot of you said, hey, why don't you just, um, you know, um, uh, tame him and then you'll have a bunch left over. Well, I don't think it was, I didn't think it was going to be that easy. And guess what? It took four bones. So please don't jump off the tree and cause a horrible, horrible accident. Either way, I now have a friend. Hey, buddy. Here, follow me. Follow me, buddy. There he is. We got to get him a new collar. This red collar is just too mainstream. Anyway, guys, welcome back to another episode. I'm so happy that you joined me. I'm having a great time with this series. I now have a friend to go along with me on my journey. And we are going to head, I believe, southerly. No, northerly is where we wanted to go. And then maybe we'll eventually head west again, right? Yeah, let's keep going north. I have a friend with me now. This is very, very exciting. Let's see what we can find. And not too far from where we tamed our friend is this building. Ooh, is this like an old train station or something? Wait a second. Fuel. There's a couple chests in here. This is exciting. Ooh, this is nice. I don't think I can make this a temporary home. It's a little too dilapidated for me to do that. Rusty lattice. Oh my gosh, what do I open for? This is going to be... Oh, this anvil. Hold on. Was that you making noise? Oh, you better not hurt yourself. You're okay, right? You're okay? You better be okay. So this is the problem with having these friends. <laughs> they, uh, they start becoming issues. Okay, so there's some charcoal there. I don't think I'm going to take any of the rail or the mine cart with furnace. I will take all this charcoal. I'm guessing all the furnaces will have charcoal. That's nice. Fuel. <gasps> More charcoal. Oh my goodness. I will not need fuel for the rest of my journey. This is ridiculous. Hold on. How much is in here? There's a whole lot in here. Black granite blocks. We can make those later. Uh, we don't need two axes. Oh my goodness. That's a lot. Buddy, I'm going to need you to come up here because you are making me very, very nervous. Oh, that was uh, stone. There you go. Here, here, sit. Sit right there. Sit right there and relax. All right. So, we've got some fuel. I'm going to go ahead and remove... Oh, no. The rotten flesh is probably good to give them, right? So, I'll keep the rotten flesh. Um, let me get organized very quickly here. Uh-oh. Buddy, we, we, first of all, we need to give you a name. Second of all, I took a little too long in uh, cleaning up my inventory, and now it's getting dark, and I don't have wool. Let's look at these chests real quick. Mine carts. Oh, yeah, I checked that one already. More mine carts. Oh, this will be nice. Well, oh, this is really nice, actually. An entire stack of iron. That's really good. We can actually make some iron armor, and that is pretty much it. I'm going to take this anvil, and then we're going to have to find a hole in the ground. And wait for day because I do. I'm gonna take all the anvils because I don't have wool for beds. Good morning, bud. You're as excited as I am, guys. I didn't have any wool, but what I did have was string. So I did make a bed. I did sleep in it. So my spawn is set here. If we die, we will end up right back here. And I believe this was northwards. Nope. This was northwards. We're going to keep heading north. This is a nice little stop. I got a lot of iron out of it. Definitely a lot of charcoal. I don't think I'm going to have to mine for coal ever again. And I hope I'm not missing anything buried beneath it because that's always my worry. What's this? The Bells of Ireland. Well, that's a beautiful name for a plant. All right, bud. Let's go. Careful, bud. Careful. Do not fall off. Things are dangerous around here. Okay, sheepers. 
It's nice to see you. I need a little bit of your wool. Um, you're gray, but I will still take your wool. In fact, I'll probably take all this sheep's wool. Who knows? Maybe when I settle down, I'll want to make myself a little carpet. And wool is definitely important in the building of carpets. Um, this is a nice wide open plains biome. I don't... I think there's like some dead forest over there or something which doesn't seem very pleasant then again i have been to i believe i've been to that biome there so maybe we just go straight ahead and see what we find it looks like we're going to come up on that dead forest regardless though the amount of wool i've gotten from this area warrants a naming on the map i mean this whole area is just packed with sheep i shall name it um wide not wife wide wool flats i think that's a pretty cool name and we will put a we will put a one of these guys wide wool flats i don't even know what that is so let's just leave it with yeah let's just leave it at that done wide wool flats that's kind of cool right like if we ever need wool and we're in the area <laughs> this is the spot to come of course eventually i'd like to have my own little um wool farm or sheep farm and all kinds of animals and stuff so we'll we'll get there eventually that looks eerie down there, doesn't it? It's just a cave, but I wonder, I wonder if, oh, that was spooky. I think it just leads to like a little, oh, there's, there's a zombie, uh-oh. Bud, I can handle this, you don't have to. I said you don't have to. Oh, I get a little worried. I know this is going to be a problem now. This is definitely going to be a problem because I'm going to keep worrying about his well-being. Oh, what did you guys do to me? <laughs> you guys kind of you guys kind of handcuffed me a little bit. No, it's good though. I love having a friend to do this stuff with. All right, we're not going to get too into the cave. We did a lot of caving not too long ago, so let's get the heck out of here, bud. <laughs> oh, I think his name's going to have to be Bud. I don't know unless you guys can come up with a better name. That kind of suits the uh, the series. His name might just be Bud. Boy, does this place look cold. Ooh, it's a good thing Bud here <laughs> has, some, uh, has some nice shaggy fur on him. Wonder what we'll find in this biome. Hopefully a nice warm, cozy cabin. That'd be kind of nice. Look at this nice little river leading out into the ocean here. This is gorgeous. This is beautiful. Look at that. Oh, should we follow the river up? There's another little tiny waterfall there. That is really cool. What do you think, bud? Let's go. Why not? Ugh, this water's pretty cold, though. Still following the river here, and I came across a pear tree. I don't, I don't remember if I got one already, so I'm definitely going to take this opportunity to grab one. Maybe two. Be careful, bud. Whenever I see Mossy Cobble, I think Spawner. What is this? It looks like an infinite... <laughs> it's an infinite water well? Oh, it looks like this generated underneath this tree. Okay. What is that? Wither Skull. Oh! I'll take that. That was probably... That sh I shouldn't have done that. That could have been a trap. That could have been something horrible. Come here. Come here, bud. Here, sit down. We gotta get you a new collar. What do I have? Oh, this makes green dye. I've never seen a dog with a green collar. Buddy! Buddy! Oh, the green collar looks so good on you! It's perfect. Now you wait here while I'll invest while while I investigate this a little bit further. I'm a little bit worried. Let me see. I'm gonna get some blocks in here and maybe soak up this water. I got a lot from Wide Wolf Flats. Um, I am a little concerned. <gasps> I knew it. I knew it had to have something. 
Oh, there's a ladder there. Uh, should I go down there? I'm a little... Oh, man, this is... Ugh. Okay, okay, so it stops here, I think. Right? I think it stops here. We're just gonna go ahead and dig a little bit here. Oh! My goodness. <gasps> oh! Cotton seeds, white mushroom spores. Oh, what do I do? I don't think I have the room in my backpacks for this stuff. They're all like... Oh, man. Now, I have a lot of this stuff already, I think. But I'm sure I don't have all of it. Oh, man. Oh, okay. Hmm. Food, other blocks. Cy the cyan backpack has some food in it. This is not good. This is going to kill me not to be able to take these. Oh, no. The cyan backpack is the goods. Uh, The food. Oh, this this backpack has. Oh, no. I can't. I'm not, I'm not going to take anything. Ginger, garlic, celery. I don't think I have celery yet. Parsnip, onions, beets. Okay. No, it's fine. It's fine, guys. We've got a lot of these guys. Look, at these are all gardens. I'm sure. I'm sure I have all of these in those gardens and if I don't I will get them eventually oh my goodness that was unbelievable that was a nice little surprise I thought this was going to be a bad place to be turns out it's a pretty good place bud where are you you missed you missed an incredible find bud bud <gasps> he's already starting to scare me let's go What are those? What kind of tree is that? Huh. Hold on. Hold on. I'm going to find out. Hold your horses. We have no horses to hold. What is this? Gooseberry? Can I... Are any of these ripe? I don't think so. I thought... Do, do gooseberries grow on trees? I always thought gooseberries grew on, like, bushes and stuff. I could be wrong about that. Gooseberries. What are the uses of this? A mince pie? Fruit crumble, gooseberry milkshake, that sounds delicious, gooseberry pie. Now, as far as I know, gooseberries can be very bitter or very sweet, and there's like no in between. Oh, I can't wait to make baits for my traps. Oh my gosh, guys, we have to find a place to settle. Let me just reiterate, when I do find a place to settle, okay, I'm not going to spend all my time there. I'm still going to go out exploring, but I'll have a place to store my things, to set up animal traps maybe we won't set animal traps um you know stuff like that places to a place to experiment whoa, with stuff that um doesn't really make much sense like there's going to be fish traps fish traps are going to be exciting i can actually start cooking meals like good wholesome meals for myself and bud but yeah until we find that place though we're gonna we're gonna keep exploring we got four gooseberries. Come on, but Wow, that green collar. I really like the way that green collar looks on you. By the way, I'm still headed in... Well, I was headed north, and then I ran into water. And you guys know how it goes with uh, dogs and water. I don't want to lose them across an ocean. So I'm starting to head westwards now. Westerly. And um, he's keeping up with me nicely. Oh, what is going on up here? Looks like another biome and a lot of water. Guys, is that a blue jay? I didn't even know. Had I seen birds already in this mod pack? I don't think I had. Hi, buddy. Do you fly or do you just walk around? It's got to be a blue jay, right? He's very scared of me. I'm not going to hurt you. Okay, I'll, I'll keep my distance. That's really cool. Now, hold on. Is there like, is there like a, a bird anything? There's... Spawn bird, spawn bird, blue bird, that's a hanging plant, bird of paradise, which is another hummingbird bush. I was wondering if there was maybe like a bird cage. <laughs> Not that I'd want to cage him. <laughs> I mean, who wouldn't want to look at that beauty all day? He's just hiding in the tall grass there. It's okay, bud. It's okay. And bud is friendly. Well, I called you bud too. I call everything bud, apparently. I'm sorry that I called the bird bud. Bud. Let's keep moving. 
and just by the bird is this vill- I hear it again. I- There it is! I wonder if that's the same one! Probably not. Well, maybe he's following me. Maybe he wants to keep an eye on me. These are carnations. Oh, ho, 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 ho. that's another thing I can do when I uh, when I finally find a place to settle down is I can start a little a little plant a little flower garden even. Let's see what's up here. Oh, this is a bigger than I thought village. Okay, this is a this is a relatively large village. There are books in here. I don't think there's a chest in there. What is this thing? Emerald rose. That looks important. What can I do with it? It's a lime dye. Ooh, that's gonna be a cool hanging plant. Should I try to No no no, we're not gonna we're not gonna die. Oh. There's something on the horizon down there. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're going to explore this village first. Careful, bud. Don't want you falling off the edge. And then we're gonna check out whatever the heck that is. Could it be a nice cozy cabin? <laughs> That'd be great. Well, the village didn't have much to salvage, but what is that? You ready, bud? Let's go check it out. Hmm... This doesn't look like a welcoming place. You know what? Stay here, bud. You stay here. You be safe. There's a bed in there. <gasps> there is a chest, I believe. Yes, I believe I saw a chest. Where is the... There's a window. There's a chest downstairs, too. Okay, here's the front door. Not bad. This little boat. I think this is a little boat on the side. That's adorable because it's right by the water. Oh, it's perfect. Nothing there. Acacia fancy workbench. That is a fancy workbench. What do we got? Oh, look at... Oh, my gosh. That's awesome. I will take the fish traps. I will take the bait. And I will take the raw fish. I don't need any of this other stuff. I can make that myself. What is upstairs now? A name tag. We can name Bud Bud. I've already got one of these. I can probably use one of these. Why not? And I'll take some more string as well. A nice little balcony. <gasps> Bud, it's actually pretty safe. Come. Let's make it official, Bud. Let's make it official. You are my Bud. It's short for Buddy, but I call you Bud. So your name shall be Bud. How do you like it? There you are. You're playing around out back. Okay, there you go, Bud. Oh, Bud, I'm so happy. You guys made the best decision voting for the dog. I spent some time organizing my inventory and it's time to take a nap. I'm going to go ahead and sleep in this stranger's bed because I'm sure they wouldn't mind. I've already taken a lot of their things. The least I can do is sleep in their bed. Where's Bud? Is he waiting for me? <gasps> there he is. Bud, are you ready to continue our adventure? There we go. That's what I was waiting for. Another bird. Where is it? I hear it. I, there it is. It's a cardinal. Oh, man. A blue jay and a cardinal. We get a lot of those, actually, um, where I live. Both types. Oh, I love that. That's so good. So good. Did you see that, bud? Look at how cool this biome looks. This is actually called a sludge pit biome. I'm kind of excited and nervous to explore this thing. I mean, it's called a sludge pit biome. How good can it be? First, we must sleep. It's morning. Are you ready? Let's go, my dude. Hmm, we got a bit of a dilemma here. Should we continue on in here or... Boom. I think we're going over there. Oh, there's a horse there. Ooh, hold on. Where's my other... 
backpack. Do I have a saddle? I don't have a saddle. Okay, that's okay. That's okay. Let's go and check out whatever the heck that is. Bud, I'm gonna need you to, to just sit and chill. Don't come after me if things get hairy. I need I need food too, but before food, what do we have? These are really nice mossy cobblestone blocks. I like these a lot. This is just like like an old ruin. It looks like it. Is there any chest in here? Under no, that's just a block. There's gravel there, which uh, oh, there's another bit of gravel here. Anything? Oh, baby! Get out! A green backpack. There's, there's nothing in it, but I will... That's amazing! Oh, if only I had found this before I found all those seeds. Okay. Alright, I think it'll be fine. It'll be fine. We don't need those seeds. We'll end up with exactly all of the vegetables, fruits and vegetables. Oh, you little horse. Yep, yep, if I had a saddle, you'd be mine too. You and Bud, you'd be following me to the ends of the Minecraft Earth. Where did I leave Bud? <laughs> Whoa, buddy, check it out. This rock matches your collar. What kind of rock is this? Can I peek from here? Can I maybe get a, a reading here? Maybe not. Here, let me just get one further down. I really want to know what this is. Is it schist? It is. Green schist. So there's blue. Is it schist or schist? I have no idea how to pronounce this stuff. Oh, get away from the edge, please. My goodness. Anyway, that green rock looks kind of cool. Is there something down there? I don't think so. I think my eyes are just playing tricks on me. This isn't a very pleasant biome. It's very dark. It feels like it even gets darker as you're walking through it, which is strange. What is that? That is a that is a mud guy, a mud slime. Okay, this could get ooh, this could get dangerous there, bud. I don't think I have any arrows on me. Unless it's in miscellaneous. It doesn't even have a face. It's a glob, it says. Okay, so it does drop slime balls. Ooh. Okay, we might need those slime balls later, actually. Oh, gosh. These guys seem faster than regular slimes. They also seem to drop mud balls. Okay, 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 okay. I mean, that's a lot of slime balls. If I want to make sticky pistons at some point, 16 of them. That's not bad at all. Whew, buddy, I appreciate you standing by and not helping. I really do. We are currently in a dead swamp. And I hear something very dead. Oh, boy. Okay. Okay. Little snake guy. We're just gonna we're just gonna keep on moving. We're just gonna go this way. Okay. I do I do wanna kinda have a closer look at you though. Oh it's looking right at me. I think it's mad. Hi! Oh oh jeez! Oh oh not good! Not good! Oh no! Puppy no! No, bud! Bud, no, no, no. Bud, I gotta give him food. I gotta give him food. Food, 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 food. Uh, other, uh, uh, B. I have this. Rotten flesh. Will you eat rotten flesh? Oh my gosh. That was my fault, Bud. I'm so sorry. Where's the meat? Where's the meat, Bud? I have a, I have a food backpack. Where's my food backpack? Other blocks? That is the food backpack. Is it in, is it in other? Oh, wait. It's this one. What am I doing? Oh, the panic. The panic is really setting in. Okay, come here, bud. Oh my goodness. Those things are deadly. Did bud kill it for me? I don't see any drops. Or did it just, like, run away? I don't even know. Bud, don't get in that water. I don't know what that stingray will do to you. Oh, he's a hero. He's a hero. Dude. You're awesome. Buddy. Oh, that could have been very, very bad. Let's be very careful. Uh-oh. 
Uh, maybe we'll go around. I don't like this place. I've come across something interesting. No, it's not those horses. It's these two things. What in the world are these two things? This is a sundial, and that's a sundial. I think there's two sundials, like, right next to each other. I wonder what sort of ancient civilization built these... And why they had two of them right next to each other. Maybe they were just really obsessed with the correct time. Do these hide any secrets, guys? Oh, man, I, I hesitate to, to mine under the, underneath, but I almost feel like I have to. Just just maybe just a, a row here under the actual dial itself. Yeah, I don't think it's going to have anything. Um, okay. All right, that's fine. That's fine. It's kind of a cool find. Right? This massive sundial, and then this massive sundial. <laughs> a lot of sundials happening. Huh. I found a beautiful area here with massive trees. What is this? It's a dense forest biome. And I just noticed next to it is this beautiful donkey. But even better... That. I don't know what that is, but we're about to find out. This donkey, though, I would love a donkey in this game. I really would. I mean, I have a donkey in real life, and he is just... <laughs> he is just the best. I, I love donkeys. I love them so much. What is this thing? It looks like some sort of... My horses need fodder. Whoa, is this a mission? Hold on, bud. Hold on. My horses need fodder. <gasps> this is a stable. Look at this place. You don't have any horses though, bro. Hay for leads. Hay for name tag. Hay for a saddle. Hay for iron horse armor. <gasps> this this is good. This is good. This is good. I'm sorry, sir. I'm sorry. I must protect this is really good. Oh, boy. Okay. All right. I'm excited. Guys, I have a very important question to ask you. This could change how this series looks. I will still continue to explore. However, now is the time to make a big decision. I desperately want a donkey. And the guy that we just found, he's got everything necessary for us to tame and keep a donkey. However, I don't think we found our building biome yet. It's not its not exactly the life in the woods I was picturing. Now it is good, don't get me wrong, but it's not as dense as I would like. And so even though he's got everything necessary for a donkey, what do I do? Do I tame a donkey and deal with the fact that I can't really cross any oceans anymore? Or do I pass on the donkey and continue exploring until we find a permanent location? The choice is yours. You guys made a really good decision with the dog. I'm very, very happy about that one. Now I'm trusting you to make this decision. Do we get the donkey now or do we pass it up in favor of more exploration? Because I don't think that this is the biome for us just yet. I was picturing something a little bit more dense. So yeah, big decision guys big decision hope you guys enjoyed this episode please remember to support the series by clicking the like button and subscribing if you haven't subscribed already and click the notification bell to be notified every time i upload a new video i'm having a ton of fun doing this series and you guys seem to be enjoying it so please let's keep it going thank you so much for watching i'll see you in the next one Bye bye